Hi, I'm Chris Weber from Blue Coat Systems, and I'm going to show how operations and IT folks can take advantage of the speed, power, and flexibility of Blue Coat Reporter 9.1 to better understand the costs associated with their network usage. We're on the customizable dashboard in Reporter 9.1. I can drag and drop any of the reports that you see to move them around. I can edit what's in those reports. I can remove them completely with his X, or I can add custom or existing reports from the Add Report button. Now I mentioned that we wanted to think like operations folks or IT folks and understand network costs a little bit better. Let's drill in and see who my top users are as far as bandwidth cost goes. When I pull up this bandwidth cost per user report, we're going to see the top users as far as, as the cost of their usage goes. Now, this cost is not built into Reporter 9.1. The cost is configurable based on our company's actual network costs. Now here, it looks like Joseph Miller is the winner with $364 worth of usage over the last, oh, it looks like 35 days. Now, I prefer this to be exactly a 30-day report so that at any time I can look back through the last 30 days and know. It's just as easy as going into my report options, and instead of picking all dates and reporting on that, I'll tell Reporter just to grab the last 30 days worth of information. Here's my all dates, and I'm going to grab the previous 30 days. Now I'll apply that filter, and we should see something very similar, but now it will always only be going 30 days back. Now this report data you can see says that the filter date is the previous 30 days. Joseph Miller is still our winner. The costs are a little less because we have narrowed down our time frame. And now what I'd like to do is save this and put it on my dashboard. So I'm going to save this as 30 day cost. And now when we go to our reports, we'll see this custom report that I've just made. In unfiled reports, we've got our custom report. That's a bandwidth usage thing, so I'm going to add it to my bandwidth usage group. Now on my reports page, you can see my new 30-day cost report. And I mentioned I also wanted to add it to my dashboard. Now I'm on my customizable dashboard. Now, when I'm thinking about the costs, it's not so important to me to know, for example, the block websites. So I'm going to remove that report entirely. And now I'm going to add my new custom report that I just made. I stored that in bandwidth usage, and here's 30-day costs. It appeared here at the bottom, but I'd like it to be a little more prominent, so I'm going to drag this report up to the top, edit it to show a graph, and then apply my changes, and now I've got my 30-day costs very easy to see on my custom reporter dashboard. It's this type of flexibility that means not just operations and IT, but also, for example, HR folks have the information they need to make the right, smart decisions for their network, for their users, and ultimately for the business.